Now this is my wind turbine generator. This is the upper magnet plate and one stator and a middle magnet plate, top bottom magnet, the lower stator and a bottom magnet plate. Now on the top I did it the stator this one a nine coil having it and the coils is 70 wind and uh, 20, uh, 14 gauge now the lower stator also nine coil and about uh, 100 tony wind and 22 gauge wire doubled up and uh, <coughs> The reason I done it that way because uh, <coughs> the finer winding is a lot more sensitive for voltage and the stronger winding it's a lot more uh, give a lot more power amperage and so I tried out with a battery and uh, until I mean uh, the generator not will create the voltage as the battery for, for instance 11.5 uh, until that will go free and why I like it very much that way because that way <coughs> the wind have good chance to to catch up and uh, turn it the wind turbine now I'm making that video in my automotive shop now this is the rectifiers over here on an aluminum angle piece and uh, the top and the bottom and uh, the reason I doing it that way so if something happened with one of the stator still I can use another one and I will bring down I will bring down uh, two individual wire with uh, two wires in them so that way I able to control individually the stators and also uh, I able to lock up the stator individually now for example look at this if you if uh, if I turning that and you see how I put on the brake when I close the two wires together and uh, and so that I won't do that that way so when the charging come up or or a big wind or something I can actually lock up the wind turbine with a switch from the bottom uh, when uh, just I I short the two wire together and that not will cause any harm anything now I I was thinking about it the most of the guys who making the cross axis and uh, they just install it just like that and they put it on the roof like that but I was thinking I like to cover it up so I bought a pan galvanized pan and I cut off the bottom rim so made it a little bit a little bit narrower and I cut out the top and so what I will do that will be installed just like that just like that and uh, 
and so that will be protected from the weather and now for the top after that goes that part on it and one two three four five six we'll have six blade on it and uh, and uh, that blade bracket will hold the pan the covering pan to the to the magnet plate 